Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of EDI Doors. This video, we've done a catfish catch a cook. So you guys, stay tuned. Come right up on EDI Doors. Alright guys, like I said, um, if you guys saw my last video, um, we, we did a little jugging, caught a couple catfish. And I want to do this video. It's going to be a continuation of that. We're just going to do a catch, clean, and cook. So, um, yeah. Now, if you guys haven't seen the video, check it out and put a link above in the description. You guys see it. So, first catfish, the smaller one, we already got it um, cleaned out and filleted. And we're going to go ahead and fillet the big one. I'm going to set the camera down. I'm going to do work. I'm going to show you guys and talk to y'all and let you know. It's a pretty simple um, process. So, just watch. So, pretty simple. Get the fillet knife sharp knife and I just use two pair of pliers. Catfish, they don't have scales like regular fish, they have uh, skin and you have to just skin them. You just strip the skin off of the fish. So what you're gonna do is take your fillet knife, you're gonna cut a slit down the back, right down the back from the tip of the head down to the tail. You're gonna cut down the side right behind that first fin. Just a slit right down. And you're basically just cutting the skin. You don't have to cut deep into the meat, but just the skin. Alright. You'll be able to just slice through that skin. Alright, so take my needle nose pliers, grip just the top jaw or bottom jaw, hold the fish. Take your pliers, grip the skin where you cut, and pull it off. It, usually if I have several fish, I'll take a spike or like a big nail, uh, nail it to the tree and then just take the heads and nail the heads to the tree and use it just to keep the fish from sliding. Like I said, they do have skin instead of scales, so they're really slippery, kind of hard to grip. So I take a pair of pliers, hold one in, take my other pliers, and grip the skin and just peel it right off of the body. All right, one side done, same thing on the other side. But these have really tough skin. They're bottom feeders. Channel cats, cleaner meat, but they're also a good catfish, nonetheless. All right, once you got them, have them skinned real good. Take a knife and you're cutting those fillets right off, and you're literally just filleting the meat off of the bone. You don't want to puncture the uh, belly, but you're gonna cut down to the spine, just like any other fish, and then just follow that spine all the way down. filleting that meat right off. Alright, you guys know how I like to cook my Golden Krispies. You got a uh, Frank's Red Hot Sauce. A little marinade right there. It does not make them hot. It does not taste like Frank's at all. Just add seasoning, flavor, and batter. So, let those sit for about 10 minutes. Over here we got the uh, Zatarats Fish Fry Cornmeal. Um, people use flour, but I use cornmeal. Got a little batter in there. We got the usual Tony Sassery. Season up. A little bit of garlic powder. Chili powder. Dark chili powder. Don't need a whole lot of that. And then Old Bay seasoning. This is um, seafood seasoning and it just adds a little bit of seafood taste, flavor. Don't need a lot of that either. Alright, mix this up. And this is our seasoning. We're gonna braid it and I have the fryer outside getting hot, warming up. All right, you guys, we're outside. Got the cooker heating up, got the fish braided up. We're about to go ahead and toss those in, give them a, give them a dangle there, and uh, get some golden crispies. While it's, while it's going on, when I drop these, I'm gonna uh, take measurements on my boat. I'm gonna carpet the boat up. Probably in maybe the next video or two. I'm gonna get that done before duck season uh, because I'm gonna use my boat for duck hunting. I want it to be carpeted. Hold this insulation so it's not too uh, cold when I build my blind and also to uh, quiet down the boat a little bit for fishing. But anyway, um, I'm about to go ahead and drop them and then uh, we'll do a little taste test coming right up.
we'll give those babies about mm, six minutes. All right, y'all, the fish are floating, so it's time for the Golden Krispies to go by Golden Krispies. Look, oh, my. Just look. Oh, would you just look at it? Look at those beauties. Look at those beauties. All right. Get these bad babies inside. Let them cool off for a second and do a little taste testing. Oh, look at it. Ooh. 